Good morning everyone. My name is Akesh Gupta and I'm with Lightspeed Solutions. Today in this presentation I will share with you how to filter table data using URL parameters. To begin with, let's look at a use case. The use case is I'm logged in and I'm able to see all my accounts. Absolutely no problem there. Ironspeed does a very good job out of the box. But as you can see there are different account types. So by default I can have a prospect, a lead or a customer and when I go to my account I'm able to see different accounts in different account type statuses. What I would like to do is on an account type I would like to make this a hyperlink so that I can click on an account type and automatically be able to see on my account table all my accounts of that particular account type. But in case I'm clicking on the account from the main menu it should show me all account types. So let's see how we will go about it. So the, in reality what we're looking at is when we are clicking on an account type we would like to see all my account table but pass in a parameter via URL so that the data gets filtered. So to begin with first thing first we would basically go to the show account type ID look at our uh, 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 sorry show account type uh, table page make the field a hyperlink rather than a literal and this will become a link button and as far as the link button is concerned the button action would be that when somebody basically clicks on that it will be redirected to the specific URL in, th in this case the URL is going to be our show account table page and we are basically going to be passing in a variable by the name account type which will be from the clicked row and it will be the field value account type ID. So in reality what we are trying to do here is we are trying to convert the literal account type into a hyperlink and on click of this particular hyperlink we are really trying to go to the show account table page in addition passing in an account type as a URL parameter so that system will uh, basically know what account type ID you clicked and it will be passed automatically there. So in so basically once this is set, so this part is already set where every single thing became hyperlink. Now on the receiving page, there are two different scenarios where this receiving page is basically uh, getting focused from. One is from a menu, when somebody clicks on a menu. There we are not making any change, but if somebody is coming from an account type, in particular we would like to change the data source to say, let's actually get rid of uh, our old uh, filter from uh, one of the other demos and we would like to say on account uh, table that the account type ID should be equal to in formula we can right click we can go to my uh, functions and in environment variable we can say URL in this case we would like to change the URL parameter to account type so what we are trying to say here is take the value of the account type and of course I'm basically trying to put it in double quotes so whatever value is coming in into account types make sure it finds a match to the account type ID of course if you notice at the bottom there is a clause here which says ignore the where clause if the formula evaluates to a blank string which basically means if somebody is trying to come to the show account table page and they are not passing in a URL parameter then we will ignore this particular where clause so let's see if this will work. So I'm just going to rebuild. It will compile the application. Go back to my uh, my application. I'm going to go in, try to re-log in. Once I'm in, I can go to my account ID and I can see all my accounts regardless of what account type they, they are but if I click on my account type as you can see now they have become a hyperlink as soon as I click on lead system will automatically take me to the account table page and as you can see it did pass in a parameter of account type is equal to 2 and based on that I've already filtered my data to only show me leads let's just make sure it works for other as well so I click on customer I'm able to see all my customers but if I go to the same account table page from the menu choice I do not have any URL parameter and since I do not have URL parameter my where clause uh, filter which I did apply here is really getting ignored because of this particular statement at the bottom 
So as you can see, just by passing URL parameter and by defining a filter criteria or a where clause on a receiving show table page, you can very easily filter the data by URL parameters. I hope you enjoyed the video and keep watching for more videos. Thanks.